Today I show you how to disable Google Gemini on long press on the power button of your Android phone. When you press the power button and you long press on it, it shows you the Google Gemini instead of the power menu and to disable that, go into the settings app and in the settings app choose system, find the system setting, tap on system and in the system look for gestures. So you have the gestures right there. In the gestures look for the press and hold power button setting. For your phone this might be a little bit different but the idea of the settings are the same. Tap the option press and hold power button and here you have the setting for what the side button or the power button does and instead of digital assistant change it to power menu and now when you long press on the power button on the side button you see finally the power menu. You can have the google assistant on long press of the home button or a swipe left or swipe right from the lower side of the phone or a power button but you can also have the Gemini app somewhere on your home screen and you can start the app from there if you don't want to start the Gemini in some other way. I believe these are good options to have but the power button long press on the power button I don't like that I prefer to have the power menu option there. Thanks for watching I hope this helps you get rid of Gemini from your Android phone there is nothing wrong with Gemini it's actually useful but you should be able to use it how you want it and activate Gemini in the way you want it. Thanks for watching.